Let's learn about fluids and electrolytes, sodium. Sodium is a very important electrolyte in the body. Sodium plays an important role in the proper function of many organs, including muscles, the brain, heart, and kidneys. Sodium accounts for 90 to 95 percent of the osmolarity or concentration of the extracellular fluid, or ECF. Adults need an average of about a half a gram of sodium per day. The typical American diet is high in sodium, at about 3 to 7 grams per day. Sodium is regulated by a number of mechanisms. These include aldosterone, antidiuretic hormone, or ADH, and atrial natriuretic peptide. Aldosterone is secreted by the adrenal gland. Aldosterone targets the kidneys to promote sodium retention. The adrenal cortex secretes aldosterone in response to hormonal stimulation and by low plasma sodium. The renin-angiotensin system promotes aldosterone secretion in response to low blood pressure. Antidiuretic hormone has an effect on sodium concentration, but does not affect the amount of sodium in the body. ADH is secreted by the posterior pituitary gland in response to an increase in osmolarity or blood solute concentration as sensed by the hypothalamus. ADH promotes water retention in the kidneys. This in turn causes a decrease in plasma osmolarity. Atrial natriuretic peptide is a hormone secreted by the heart in response to atrial stretch. An increase in blood volume causes an increase in atrial stretch. Atrial natriuretic peptide targets the kidneys to inhibit sodium reabsorption. Sodium imbalances include hypernatremia, or too high plasma sodium concentration, and hyponatremia, which is low sodium concentration. In hypernatremia, the plasma sodium concentration is greater than 145 milliequivalents per liter. Hypernatremia can cause water retention, hypertension, and edema. In hyponatremia, the plasma sodium concentration is less than 135 milliequivalents per liter. Hyponatremia can cause nausea and vomiting, muscle problems, seizures, and coma. I hope you've learned something about sodium balance, and see you next time.